Metro Vancouver landlords and anyone who's a landlord in BC, July 18th, the new residential tenancies legislation takes effect and governs how you're able to terminate a tenancy. So if you own tenanted properties, you need to listen to this. The first change is you're going to be required to use the government portal. Number two, you need to have a BC EID in order to use that portal to serve these notices. So if you're a landlord, I would go and get that BC EID today. You're also going to be informed when you use that portal on under what circumstances are you allowed to serve this notice. You're going to have to provide information on who is going to occupy the home and that information is also going to be provided to the tenant. The other major change is that the notice, the amount of time that tenants have, is going to expand from two months to four months. That's a huge difference. So remember, it's going to be four months notice to be provided to your tenants. You're also going to be reminded about bad faith terminations. If you don't occupy the home for 12 months or there's a complaint, you may have to compensate your tenant up to 12 months of rent. That is the compensation for bad faith evictions. And as a reminder, you will also owe your tenants one month worth of rent. I'm Christine Copper with Sotheby's Realty. Contact me for more information.